Good morning, guys. We're gonna go film the most expensive RV in the world, the new body style Liberty Coach. Wanted to show you guys some behind the scenes of how we make these videos. We've got the Gretsch Strata Ion on deck. It's about 5.30 a.m. Got Andrew back there getting all of the cameras on chargers. It's still pretty early this morning. Got the Gretsch well lit up back there, as you can see. So I'm gonna uh, get a little caffeine going, put down some windshield time. We've got about a three hour drive to Stewart, Florida on the other coast, but it's always worth it to see what they've got going on at Liberty Coach. are probably wondering how I got connected with Liberty Coach and started making these YouTube videos and it's been a little over four years since I made the first video with uh, Frank Connick Center from Liberty Coach while I was out detailing coaches at Sturgis, South Dakota. That was in 2019. My relationship with them goes way back long before that. I was on the travel channel with Dean Laux back in 2013 or 14, I believe. When Dean hits the road, groupies flock to get a glimpse of his impressive coach, get their hands on some artwork, and talk to the legend himself. I noticed this bus actually earlier this week. This is uh, pretty pretty talented stuff you're doing. Here. Well, thank you. So there's been a lot of years of building trust and building value before I even started making these videos. There's actually a little deal that I made to get my foot in the door the first time that I wanna tell you about in a minute. But you're probably wondering, why am I going to film at Liberty Coach in a white t-shirt right now? One of the nice things about the Gretsch Strata Ion is I've got the coat closet back there with my clothes hanging. We're getting close to getting to Stewart. I'm gonna get cleaned up here. Andrew's back there getting some editing done right now. That's one of the things about having this Class B van is just the versatility and we're able to accomplish so much by being able to work on the road. He's editing the test drive comparison video right now between the new Sprinter and the old Sprinter. Mercedes-Benz recently made some big updates on their new chassis with the new engine and the new transmission. We went up to the Hershey RV show in Hershey, Pennsylvania a week or two ago and had the opportunity to test drive both of those back to back. So that's gonna be a cool video worth checking out. And I'm a big fan of that the upgrades that they've made to the Sprinter. We're gonna go film some Liberty Coaches right now and then I wanna tell you the story about the first video I filmed with Liberty Coach. So we just got done filming this Liberty Coach 902 quad slide. Another Dean Laux paint job in here. This is a 2013, best of the best right here. Another 2017. Some nice looking Liberty Coaches here. These are the best of the best. So many nice Liberties coming and going here. Nice looking 2016 right there. So we just got done filming probably the most expensive motor coach in the world here at Liberty Coach, Liberty Coach 902 Quad Slide. You can see some of these coaches in the background. But I wanted to share with you guys about, you know, how I got into this position where we have the opportunity to film these videos for the top of the top in the luxury motor coach industry. There was definitely a lot of 5 a.m. wake ups that went into probably a decade before I ever started this YouTube channel that was helping to build these relationships to help me get to where I'm at. Those of you that don't know, that haven't watched the channel for a long time, I got my start detailing RVs. In the summers, I would go up to Spearfish, South Dakota and detail RVs uh, at one of the top RV resorts in the country. Every year, Liberty Coach would have a rally there where they would bring in all the Dean Laux paint jobs and they really shine on another level. Um, and all the other, you know, $2 million and up motor coaches were at that resort as well. First summer I went up there was 2011. The summer that I was on the travel channel with Dean was either 2013 or 2014 and at that time the competition in the detailing business was pretty fierce so 
there was usually a company that would come up from Florida and compete with us. Normally, Liberty Coach would use the company from Florida. They're from Florida. We were from Arizona. They had rapport built with that company. But there was one year where that other company dropped the ball, wasn't there. Frank and the team at Liberty Coach needed to get their coaches cleaned and that was the first time I got a phone call from Frank. And I remember we took it extremely seriously. This was, you know, the big leagues of the RV detailing business. It was known in the resort if everyone saw you wash in the brand new Liberty Coach with a $150,000, $200,000 Dean Laux paint job on it, they could probably trust you with whatever their motor coach was. So some years we would get to wash those coaches for Liberty Coach coach other years you know they had it pre-arranged with the company out of florida when i did start this youtube channel i had been washing their coaches for a few years i had also worked some different rallies that they were at didn't get to spend a lot of time with frank but i remember one year frank you know thanking us for the way we you know did business we were very polite punctual on time we did good work we charged a fair price that was that I never knew what opportunities would come from that fast forward to 2019 that was the last year that I was running my detailing business and it was a, a pretty fierce competition with our competitors from Florida up there uh, we were you know both trying to wash everybody's coach and I had started this YouTube channel and I had started making a little bit of money uh, from YouTube hoping that it would eventually turn into something. I knew Liberty Coach was coming and knew that there was a good chance that the other company from Florida was probably going to be washing their coaches just because they had that ongoing relationship. I emailed Frank from Liberty Coach and told him if you let me film any Liberty Coach I will give you a free wash on your coach, which is like, you know, a couple hundred bucks, then you throw a stack or trailer on it. That's a, you know, $350 uh, RV wash that I was willing to do to make a YouTube video in hopes of making that money back on the YouTube video. I, I sent him a message on Instagram and I said, whoever monitors this Instagram, please let Frank know that I'll do this for him. He messaged me right back on Instagram and said, hey, this is Frank, I monitor this account. Send me an email with exactly what you're trying to do and we'll see if we can work something out. So I can look back, I mean, that, that email is timestamped back in August of 2019. Frank took me up on that offer and I remember for me, it was worth it for the look on our competitor's face when they saw us pulling up to the brand new Liberty Coach to wash it they were a little bit baffled at how we were able to wash this coach. Well, we were washing it for free. Frank is smart, you know, they, they saved several hundred dollars in their RV washes. And at the time I had about 4,000 followers on my YouTube channel. We made some cool videos with Dean Laux as my buddy Big Tony was out there. We washed Dean's motorcycle. And I did make a vlog with Frank, which, you know, he was on vacation, whining and dining all the Liberty Coach customers. So it was, you know, he had to take time out of his day hanging out with his wife to film a YouTube video with me. So I knew I had to make the most of it. And I put a lot of thought and a lot of effort into it. And that was the new 2020 Liberty Coach. I believe it was 866 or 861 it's been a while triple slide and just such a beautiful coach and I remember as soon as I got back to my RV I edited like a madman I could not get that video live fast enough I was so excited to be able to interview Frank Connick Center on the YouTube channel show the newest best Liberty coach and I remember some of the comments where people you know definitely took me seriously on another level because I went from a guy just out washing RVs, goofing around, making YouTube videos to in-depth interview with Frank Connick Setter, who's at the top of the food chain of the luxury motor coach industry. Now I wanted that video to do well and I remember it got like 100,000 views in the first week. I was really excited, maybe 20,000 views in the first day. I mean, it was an absolute home run. Definitely made my money back and some from the RV wash from the YouTube video. I think it ended up getting like four or 500,000 views. And you know, I was creating value for them. I was definitely trying to help 
get brand awareness for Liberty Coach and, and you know basically make a free promotional video for them to try to help build this YouTube channel. A lot of times folks think that you know like I just got lucky and boy I was the chosen one and just woke up out of bed and make these YouTube videos for the best motor coaches in the world but uh, it's definitely not the case. I started out literally basically paying them to be able to make these videos. Frank didn't have to do that either. So, you know, it's a, it's a two-way street and I really appreciate Frank giving me that opportunity the first time to be able to, to film that coach. A couple weeks later, I remember I got a phone call from Dean Laux on my cell phone while I was driving back to Arizona from South Dakota. Dean was really excited about the video. A lot of people had seen it and seen the Dean Laux paint job and he had had people coming up to him at RV resorts and basically, you know, letting him know how much they enjoyed seeing the videos and seeing the, the depth of the paint jobs in the videos. Then I was out in Florida and stopped by and just asked Frank if I could make some more free videos. And you know, it eventually turned into, you know, Liberty Coach sponsoring the channel. You know, that was something that I could have never even dreamed of when I started this YouTube channel. And then it's, you know, evolved into other uh, RV manufacturers, RV dealers following the channel. But you know, Liberty was the first real relationship that I had in the RV industry and and they're the you know top of the food chain 2.9 million dollars a lifetime workmanship warranty to the original owner that warranties squeaks and rattles I've never heard of anybody in the RV industry ever talking about warranting squeaks and rattles for the lifetime of the coach to the original owner, just unheard of. And there's a lot of other, you know, awesome motorhomes out there. I've been very thankful for the relationship with Newell Coach. I'll have to tell that story sometime about how I was able to get in the door with Newell Coach. They say that opportunity is disguised in the form of hard work. Uh, and I would say that my story is a testament to that. When I was out, you know, getting up at 5 a.m. to go switch out DI filters so we could wash coaches all day uh, four or five years ago, I could not have dreamed of what was ahead and, and, you know, a lot to be thankful for that this YouTube channel has brought me in life. So wanted to take a quick minute to just kind of share with you guys that story. I'm forever grateful for that opportunity and I appreciate all of you that follow this YouTube channel that really make these opportunities possible because without all of you watching, there would be no value for me to reciprocate and, and you know provide value to Liberty Coach and the other RV manufacturers out there. So really appreciate all of you and I hope you're all having a great day. Thanks again.